What's up guys, Shane Sarnes here with Droid Modder X. Today I'm going to quickly show you guys how to unlock the bootloader on your Moto X Pure. The whole process should take us about five minutes or so and you're going to need a PC or Mac. You're going to need to have the SDK installed or you'll need to have at the very least the ADB files, the fast boot files. You need to have the Motorola drivers installed and all the files will be in the description below. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay guys, so on your phone, you're gonna to wanna to go into your settings. You're gonna to wanna to go down to about phone. Go all the way down to where it says build number. Go ahead and click on that several times until it says you are now a developer. You go back, open up developer options. Make sure this OEM unlocking is turned on and USB debugging is turned on. From there, you're just gonna go ahead and plug in your phone. Okay, so when you connect your device, it'll say allow USB debugging. Go ahead and select always allow from this computer and hit okay. Okay, once you've done that, you should be able to type ADB devices and it should see your phone. Okay, and there is our device listed there. Okay, so the next thing you'll do is head to motodev.com. I'll include a link in the description. Okay, so go ahead and power off your device, then press the power and volume down buttons at the same time. It's gonna boot you into fast boot mode. Okay, so once you are in fast boot mode, we'll go ahead and plug our phone into the computer. Okay, so we'll go back to our command prompt. We'll type fast boot. OEM space get underscore unlock underscore data. Hit OK. Okay, and then you'll get a string of code here. So here you're going to want to right click up top, hit edit, and hit copy. Okay, and then we'll just kind of copy our code here. Okay, so go ahead and paste that into a text document and remove all the unnecessary junk. This basically needs to be one line of code with no spaces and no extra stuff. Okay, so now we're going to copy that and then go back into the Motorola website and we will paste it here where it says check if your device can be unlocked. So we'll go ahead and click can my device be unlocked. Okay, you'll go ahead and agree and request the unlock key. It says, unless you have a developer edition device, this will void your warranty. Are you sure? We're gonna go ahead and select okay. Okay, so you should receive an email. Uh, be sure to check your spam folder if you don't automatically see it. And then also I noticed that if you try to use the Google login, so like just using your Google account to log in, it wouldn't send me an email. You actually have to go in and register an account and give them an email for them to send it to. So what you'll do is you will copy your unlock code. Okay, and then you'll go back to your command window. You're just gonna type fast boot OEM unlock, and then you are going to space and then uh, paste in your code, hit enter. Okay, that's gonna go ahead and bootloader unlock your phone. So you're done, it says unlock successfully. And then now if you look at your phone, uh, you'll notice that it says device is unlocked. So that's it. You are now bootloader unlocked. You are able to flash a custom recovery and root your device nice and easy. So we'll go ahead and click the start button. It says warning, bootloader is unlocked. So there's actually a way to get rid of this and I'll be sure to uh, put up a video on how to get rid of that. But we're booting into Android now with our bootloader unlocked. I believe that wipes your data. So be sure to back up any important information, any important documents prior to unlocking your bootloader. Anyways, guys, that about wraps it up for that video. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at droidmoderx.com. Follow me on Twitter at droidmoderx. Thanks, guys, for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.